Hey, what's going on guys? It's Chimney Surf here and welcome back to my new favorite game, Slime Rancher, in the series that I'm doing here for you guys called Slime Rancher Road to Golden Honey. It's currently day four. Um, now, between episode three and four, so this, obviously I'm this episode I'm recording, but uh, I've recorded episodes one through three in one sitting. Uh, the reason for that was because I got super addicted and didn't want to stop. But uh, the reason I'm telling you that is because I know a lot of the comments on episodes two and three were like, Jim, didn't you see our, ep or our my comment on episode one? You got to do this and this and this. And the reason I didn't see them was because it was pre-recorded. So I took a look at a bunch of your guys' comments and you guys had some really awesome advice. Looks like prices just went down. I'm not sure what constitutes that. I'm not sure what, what causes that to happen. Is it an internet thing? Is it like, is it an actual market across the game that does that? Uh, I'm not sure, but uh, I did a little bit of playing between episodes and took a look at some comments. You guys had some great tips. Most of the comments seem to be warning me about the tar slimes. Um, so I don't want to put, you know, uh, three different types of slimes into one container. I guess if, like, I guess if these Largo slimes here were to eat a tabby, tabby plort, um, they would turn into tar because they, these are a mix between pink and rock slimes. So I can't do that. I, I want to avoid the tar slimes unless we want to have some fun someday. And that could be kind of, that could be kind of interesting. Um, all right. So some more cube foods or uh, cube berries are ready, which is great. And so, like I said, I did some playing between episodes and check it out. I got a tabby slime. Boop, it's a little cat. So what we're going to do today, and I did, I got some monies too. I worked on, uh, just doing a little bit of farming and getting some money. So we've got, um, 1400 new bucks right now and let's go ahead and set up a new corral purchase and we are going to put our tabby slime in here now i don't know a whole lot about tabby slimes it's the first time i've encountered one so tabby slimes let's see their favorite uh, their diet is meat and their favorite is a stony hen tabby slimes share many curious slime uh or similarities <laughs> to domesticated house cats on of earth uh, with their pesky ears, striped backs, and swaying tails, you'd almost mistake them for a true feline. If they weren't entirely, uh, made entirely of gooey slime, of course. Rancher risks. A tabby slime generally doesn't mean any harm to a rancher, but like their spiritual earth cat cousins, often causes a great deal of chaos anyway. Tabby slimes love to steal things uh, they don't eat, like fruits and veggies, resulting in lots of unintended Largo transformations on the range. Ooh, so we should probably contain them in it with a with a with a roof uh plort plortonomics tabby plorts are a key ingredient in a variety of performance enhancing products that grant the consumer a surge of the tabby slime signature energy and exuberance uh that sounds cool and while athletes uh the world over uh take them to gain an edge prolonged use often results in uncontrollable butt wiggles yeah i can see that happening uh, another less desirable signature of the tabby slime Okay, so it seems as if they like to cause a little bit of mischief. Now, can they jump out? No, the single one can't, but I would be willing to bet you that multiple would cause some issues here. So we can do high walls for right now. Um, air net, yes. All right, so we got 800 new bucks still. What's our quest currently? 10 heartbeats, I don't have that, and 13 carrots, I don't have that either. Uh, actually, carrots are over here. Let's take a look. Yeah, but those aren't ready yet. We can also look at some upgrades today. I know a lot of you guys said you wanted me to get a jetpack. A jetpack it is. Oh. Oh, maybe that is determined by my stamina. Oh, that's sweet. Whoa. I just got to a secret spot. Oh, that's right. I was seeing videos and people were showing like secret areas and stuff that you could get to in these maps. This is amazing. Whoa! Oh, don't break the game. All right, we gotta wait for this to recharge. Is there gonna be a secret somewhere? Oh, this is gonna be cool. Let's go up here. Come on. Uh, get up there, you can do it. Yes! Yes! Oh, wow! We are on top of the world. That is pretty cool. Let's see if we can go. I want to kind of go this way. See what happens if we go this way. 
And if not, we can always just jump down. If, things, if we don't like how, how things are getting here, if we bug out or something. But look at this, we can walk across the, the cliff tops. That is cool. This is cool. Oh, can we fly across here? <gasps> yes, we did it. We did it. Okay, excellent. And I know a lot of you guys were also telling me that the uh, phosphor slimes, um, they burn up in in the nighttime uh, or in the daytime. I I knew that. Uh, I just didn't really care about them. <laughs> so we've made it back unintentionally. I mean, we were going across the rooftops here. We made it back to the area in which we were last episode. This is the furthest I this is the furthest I I had gotten. There's a lot of money laying around, a lot of pink plorts laying around that we could grab, but I'm kind of interested in moving forward um, over here and seeing what's. I think I'm, I think I'm low on hens actually. Oh, and roosters. Didn't something eat? Oh my guys! Oh, these are the tar slimes. Oh, yep. Listen to the music change. Oh, they're going crazy. That's not good. Yeah, so these guys just wreak havoc. And I don't know what happened over there. I think it's because there was phosphor slimes that were out and about at night. Um, so it was like rock slimes mixing with pink slimes mixing with phosphor slimes. That's, con that's a problem. <laughs> that's what causes the tar. Okay? I got it. I got it. All right, so let's go ahead and we need to restart our our chicken farm over here. Let's go ahead and feed these. Oh gosh, these guys are not doing great. Neither of these guys. I should have paid more attention. Um, another thing we can do is actually upgrade these areas. Uh, you can make. Oh gosh. You can use these little buttons here to upgrade them and you can do like plort collectors or auto feeders But they're 500 each and I don't really have enough monies right now to do that So we should work on that uh, today as well. Maybe getting some more money. So my goal what I want to do Let's clear our inventory as best we can Let's do this and we're gonna do this. And you know what these phosphor slimes I'm gonna just shoot them out into the world because honestly like, I'm not going to really need them right now, I don't think. Um, and I can always get more. Right? Like, I can always get more. Like, if they escape, that then whatever. That's fine. So, money is big priority right now. Um, oh, boy. Money, money is big priority. But what I want to do is I want to go out and I want to get some tabby slimes. Because tabby slimes are, I think, my next best bet for money. Let me go check the board real quick. Ooh, what do we get? We got an achievement. Achievement. Up all night. What is that? Stay awake from 6 a.m. to 6 a.m. the next day. Oh, okay. Maybe I, the other nights I slept or whatever. That's kind of that's kind of cool. All right. So let's look at tabby slimes. They're 20. Although phosphor slimes are more. Well, it's daytime. So our best option is probably going to be tabby slimes if we can get enough meat to feed them. So let's go out. We're going to find some more meat. Um, Hold on. Oh, phone went off. Okay. So we're gonna go find, let's go find some chickens. Um, we got a totally empty inventory. Let's look for chickadees, like right here. Thank you. Chickadees, because those will grow up into chickens. Be very important. There we go, or chickadoos, sorry. Chickadoos is what they're called. Any other chickadees around here? Nope, these, all, these pink slimes will look very happy. And we're gonna head over here. And hopefully these tar slimes are, whoa! That's a pink cat slime. What? Pink tabby largo. That is cool. Now there was something up here that I wanted to check out. What is this? Oh, here we go. These are worth a bit. Phosphor plorts. I'll take that. All right, pink slimes, pink plorts laying all over. And let's head into the next area, okay? Did that chicken that was here go away? I think it's gone. I don't see it unless it's over here somewhere. Anywhere, little chicken. Do you guys see a chicken? Hello, Mr. Slime. Have you seen a chicken anywhere? Like, no, but if I do, I'll make sure to eat it. <laughs> that is a cool Largo looking slime there. Pink and tabby. So that, yeah, because the tabby cats, I think, are over here. The tabby slimes. This is the new area. 
And stuff's raining from the ceiling. What do we got? Whoa, look at all these chickens. Yes. Oh gosh, now this could cause some problems. Let's get these tabbies. I'm seeing three types of slimes in here, and that's making me nervous because you guys know what's gonna happen. If one of these tabby slimes eats a chicken, it's gonna cause some problems um, by making tar slimes. We don't want we don't want tar slimes, okay? So let's ooh, chick chickadoo. Let's get out of here. We've got seven more tabby slimes. Let's make that eight more tabby slimes. We've got some rock slimes over here. Let's grab this guy. Nine. So this will be a total of ten tabby slimes in our new corral in our ranch here on Road to Golden Honey. Now a lot of people were also confused about the name of my series. They thought that I was trying to make a golden honey slime. No, that's not possible. Um, I basically the the goal of the series is to uh, you know raise and grow a big farm of honey slimes and maximize our profit with the honey plorts and also. If we somehow find some golden ports along the way, that is our goal as well. So, road to golden honey. And honey, honey's kind of a golden color too, right? So, we got tabby slimes today. This is exciting stuff. Let's go ahead and plunk these guys in here. Make, give them some friends. There you guys go. And I guess we'll go ahead and feed them these hen hens. Um, because we've got some chickadoos. Let me do long range from here. Oh, I missed. Darn. I tried. There we go. All right, so we're up to 724. And we're going to go ahead and put our chickadoos in here. Now, hopefully nothing will get out and get them. Let's see. All right, so we've got some cube berries. I think what I want to do, though, is actually grow something else. Um, here, carrots are ready. This is great. Carrots are all ready. So we'll keep carrots going over here because I think carrots are great for, like the veggies and don't the let's see the slimes the rock slimes eat veggies so when we get we're gonna get rid of these the largo slimes eventually I don't well I need them hungry doesn't appear that way uh cuz I know a lot of you guys were saying that like largo slimes might not be the best way to go um, and they are pretty dangerous I can't suck them up oh, whoa he just what the heck <laughs> Oh. Now, people were also saying that I could get the items through the walls, but that doesn't seem to really work. He go oh, he got out. I know he got out. Come here. Okay. This. Oh, my goodness. 60 health. I gotta grab these. What we really need to make is. Oh, gosh. Is the uh, auto feeder and auto collectors. Let's feed more carrots to these guys. Then these guys are really hungry. Get some more monies. Okay, this is crazy. Slime's going in there. Any of you that are hungry, there's a couple carrots laying on the ground, okay? Okay. All right, and then we've got, we should have some tabby plorts over here as well. Yes. Yes. And then we'll do a little upgrade before the end of this episode. Now that we're, we got four, okay. Yeah, so we're doing all right, we're doing all right. So let's go. Tabby slimes, rock plorts, or tabby plorts, rock plorts, and pink port plorts. We are back up to almost a thousand. Almost a thousand. Yes. All right, so let's grab these pink plorts. Maybe we'll get over the hump and actually get into a thousand here. That'd be really cool. Um, and yes, I know pink slimes are pretty useless when it comes to making the monies, but we will upgrade them. Uh, or upgrade that area at some point and just we'll change them out I guess if I don't need the pink slimes anymore give me over a thousand oh we don't have a thousand yet that is okay that is okay. oh wait 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 there was a hidden tabby plot in the corner that nobody saw there we go we're over a thousand okay wonderful so now what we can do is we can look at some different upgrades let's look at um let's look at perhaps Plort Collector. Purchase. So there we go. So that's over here. And what this will do is, if fed, it will feed them, or it will collect, uh, over time, will collect their plorts. And they'll come here and we can suck them out right out of here. And that way we don't have to get, see the little sucky right there? 
That way we don't have to go inside and get ourselves injured. Which I think is kind of cool. So, um, that is going to be this episode for today. Uh, episode 5, uh, I'm going to record another batch of 3 here. Um, this episode, we didn't do a whole lot, but next episode, I want to go out and really explore. Like, really explore. So, thank you guys so much for watching episode 4 of Slime Rancher Road to Golden Honey. It's been a lot of fun. Uh, we still got 500 new bucks that we can spend on different things. Dash boots, pulse wave, heart module, power core. This tank booster might be good. Yes, let's do that. That's gonna upgrade me a little bit. But guys, thank you so much for watching this episode. We'll be doing another episode very, very soon. And I'll see you guys in that one. Peace. I just slept in Slippery Dave's bed. I feel so gross. I feel so gross. Uh, all right, so let's continue to gamble here. Gamble our life savings away. Spin. Nope. Spin. Nope.